the floor. We used to go down to Grandma's house, so she'd draft to Baltimore. We'd have pumpkin pie and Reese cups and homemade rolls until she brought out the good stuff from her stash. Grandma's chocolate milk. It was nine rows wide and six rows deep, sweet, dark, creamy, and thick. It came from the udders of forty eleven cows and took a whole entire shelf full of fridge. It could feed all the kids from here to Myrtle Beach, and she'd have a couple jugs left still. We're gonna get thrown out if we keep on making fun of Grandma's chocolate milk. All the way down Myrtle Beach, they were listening to Lord of the Rings. Grandma made sure to pack her chocolate milk in one of the coolers that she brings. Whenever they'd arrive, they'd stop in at the store and go to the chocolate milk row. She'd clear them out fast, say keep the change, and haul away her precious cargo. It was nine rows wide and six rows deep, sweet, dark, creamy, and thick. It came from the udders of forty eleven cows and took a whole entire shelf full of fridge. It could feed all the kids from here to Myrtle Beach, and she'd have a couple jugs left still. We're gonna get thrown out if we keep on making fun of Grandma's chocolate milk. After dinner, we'd play a little pounce, and the old folks would wanna go to bed. But Grandma said she'd give us brownie points if we'd stay a little later instead. So we'd sit and play some Jackbox games till our brains were starting to wilt. Next thing we know, we'd wake up in the morning to Grandma's chocolate milk. It was nine rows wide and six rows deep, sweet, dark, creamy, and thick. It came from the udders of forty eleven cows and took a whole entire shelf of the fridge. It could feed all the kids from here to Myrtle Beach, and she'd have a couple jugs left still. We're gonna get thrown out if we keep on making fun of Grandma's chocolate milk.